All right, folks, we got two characters left, so enough talk. Let's get to work. Now, the interesting thing is that in the original Skullgirls, these two are locked. The only way to unlock them is by completing all the other characters' stories. Once that's done, Valentine's gets unlocked first, and after beating her, then there's Double. Up first, the Doctor's in the house. Valentine. Yep, we're back with more Skullgirls Encore. And now we're about to learn about Valentine's story. So much needles. Ugh. I'm gonna freak out just by seeing all this. Is that Valentine when she was once human or what's going on? There she is. Aw oh, damn, this is just scary. I guess I don't have any choice. It's up to her now. Pain Wheel will need to finish what I couldn't. What does that have to do with it? Valentine, there are those that would interfere with my plan. Infiltrate Lab 8 and see to it they do not. As you wish, Marie. I'll leave at once. Short, sweet, and to the point. Valentine works for Bloody Marie, and up first is Peacock. Let's rock! And let me tell you, she's really fast to use. Valentine is major combo heavy. I kid you not. I don't like. Oh, yeah, now that one. Ooh, this is beautiful. Well, she just went dead. Ooh, she even has a really good air damage. But I believe that air dash is a bit too high. What a joke. I swear, the people behind Lab Zero must really be loving this booch, I think. I don't know, but it's just a video game. I'm not I'm not gonna take it seriously. What do you expect? This game has all the characters are all girls. Until Big Band shows up. And maybe Beowulf. Time for your physical. Oh, God. Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime! Let's rock! Again. Okay, now let's do this. Come on, let's do this. Yeah, I kept saying this. I'm trying to concentrate. Okay. Alright. Now I got it. That's a really good combo to have. And got her. It works every time. It's a basic bread and butter combo, but I feel that there's a lot of damage to it. Not to mention, she can give me gather a huge load of this. Beautiful. Fast, deadly, and dangerous. Just the way how I like it with a character like Valentine. She's dangerous. Not to mention, she's one of the few characters in the whole five. What's this? Pain wheel? You. You'll pay for what you did to me, Valentine. Killing me isn't part of your directive, which means you must be somehow resisting Brain Drain's control. You have to be incredibly strong to overcome his influence. I wonder. I think this warrants further study. Oh man, Pain wheel doesn't have to express any remorse. She just comes in all angry, just waiting to tear the ever-living hell out of Valentine. Oy, she's got a grudge. Let's see if you learned any of what I can do. Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime! Let's rock! Oh, great, looks like the game decides to be. 
surgery. Ooh, yeah, that's dead. Not a thought. Oh yeah, she actually has access to needles. Different needles can help suit the situation. And I throw. Got her. Now it's poison. Here, have another. And I got her. Not good. At least we actually get an idea of how it works. Lost the will to me. Oh man, a freaky doctor. I wonder who else I gotta deal with. No. <laughs> Pathetic. I thought I made you better than this pain wheel. You're a failure. You'll never fulfill your purpose in defeat the skull girl. My purpose. My purpose is to destroy you! You are persistent, I'll give you that. Maybe you just need more time. Listen, if you're going to have any hope of exacting your revenge, you're going to have to be a lot stronger than that. If you ever get the nerve to try again, I'll be waiting for you in the grand evening. Ah, I will kill you! Good, I'm counting on it. I think Painwheel was expecting that. But it doesn't matter though, because now I have to take on Cerebella. Besides, we only got two more characters left. But I still have a few extra videos I need to prep up. This may sting. Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime! Let's do it! Let's get her the shots. And now she's poisoned. Which means poison will basically drain her health for a little while. Ooh, that hurt. Ooh, that was bad. Here, have another. Gotcha! K freaking O. That was good. Everyone has a weakness. Mm-hmm. Though I wonder if that stage reminds me of Rolentos from Street Fighter Alpha 2. It has to be. Oh, now we gotta deal with misfortune then. I'll cut you down to size. I'm ready to pounce. Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime! Let's do it. Got him. Ooh, that had a hurt. Ooh, got him with a poison. And again, yeah, it gets repetitive, but hey, it's the only combo I know that can dish out a lot of damage. Aw, oh, come on! It would've worked! It would've worked! It would've been really nice to see, like, a level 3 poison. Ooh, at least this is good. Repeater uses a poison him boost that. That's pretty interesting, to say the least. Now who are we up against? Yep, Philia. Philia is going to prove to be very big trouble. I wouldn't mind it any other way. Tisk tisk. It looks like we'll have to operate. Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime. Let's do it. <laughs> And gotcha! So I would have tried the punch hyper, but it wouldn't. Ready for your shot? Let's up the dose. This might pinch. And now let's test it out. Ooh, and a lot of poison. That really drains a lot. Holy crap, that's a lot of poison drain. Oh I get it. I can just extend the combo even further. Alright. 
Let's see if I can punish him. Yeah, I guess we're done. I'm gonna try using the punch hyper instead. But at least seeing the level 3 poison packs a lot of punch. It really does pack a lot of punch. I had no idea it actually worked. Ugh. No! You have failed, creature. The Trinity is not without mercy, and so I will make your death a victory. Stop, Double! So the Double Crosser finally drops her ruse. And for what? This experiment of yours? That experiment is my insurance policy. The Trinity does not look kindly upon traitors. Who would have thought Valentine had an agenda of her own? Ugh, really didn't see that coming. I thought Pingwheel was just excess garbage. You've disgusted me from the start. Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime! Let's rock! Come on, let's go. Come on. And knife stab. Uh oh. Huge major block stun! You can tell this is not going to be one heck of a fight. And you're done. Yeah, I'm doing all this in normal, because if I did it any higher, it would have been a real challenge. Nuts, I missed. And that move comes way fast out of nowhere. And you're done. So easy to replace. Wow. That was intense. You're still not ready, Pain Wheel. But maybe someday you won't be totally useless. Don't patronize me, Valentine. I will get stronger. And I will destroy you. It's too late for that. I'll have to take care of this myself. And if I can't, come find me and we'll try again. And again. Until you finally succeed. Come back here. This isn't over. Take care, Pain Wheel. Never thought Valentine would show that kind of pity. That's a first. Yeah, I'm still a bit ill, guys. So if you notice me, like, sniffing up, it's because I got a runny nose. Yeah. It kind of sucks. Sorry, Marie. I quit. We knew this day would come. It was inevitable and inconsequential. Destroying Lab 8 and Project Peacock was all that was required of you. Glad there aren't any hard feelings then. I know what you really are and why you're here. You're nothing more than a pawn just like me. But you let me get too close. Even if I die today, my research will aid the labs for generations. You got that? We're coming for you and your master's monster. Count on it. Enough! Just like that, she ain't wasted any time. Yep, we have to face Bloody Marie. This is not gonna be pretty. But who would have thought Valentine would be working under Marie? But now that she quit, I don't know what's going to happen. Well, maybe after this boss fight, we'll find out. This is Tuna with Bacon. Showtime! Let's do this! And she just doesn't waste any time with bringing on the pain. That's that. Can't believe I avoided that. Gotta strike hard, strike fast. That's my motto here in this one. Uh oh, form two. So I gotta move fast, because I don't want to get hit by that. Nuts. Hurry. Ah, oh, nuts. 
And I'm done. Ah, crap. The story ends. Nope, it's not gonna end. It's not over yet. Time to put on a show. Action. Let's put on a show worth watching. Whoa, oh, that was quick. Ah, I didn't do the dash fast enough. Great, that thing is dangerous. This is the only way I'm going to be able to avoid her. Since mostly her attacks will only hit when you're on the ground. Oh, now she gets dangerous. Come on, gotta get off. Finally. Adding for good measure. Done and done. Oh, that was tough. There. It's done. Now, what should I do with the Skull Heart? I can't bring back the Last Hope. I know how those wishes turned out. I'm heading deeper into enemy lines, and I'll be waiting for you, Pain Wheel. Skull Heart, I wish to become the Skull Girl. That's it? That's what she wanted? To be the Skull Girl? Be careful what you wish for, Valentine. It might come true. But now there's one thing that bugs us. What about Pain Wheel? All she wanted was to make Valentine pay for what she did. And the symbolism here, when she, that little thing that's on the scene, it's just sad. And now it makes her wonder that Valentine has succeeded. You know, there are times where I should be talking, but I didn't want to for the sake of the sending. My thoughts on Valentine goes like this. She's fast. She's dangerous. She's got a variety of different moves that can cause poison, that can cause stun, and that can also cause meter drain as well. She is a really interesting character, and get this, she's one of the few characters that actually has a few level 1s, level 2s, a level 3, and of all else, a level 5. That's right, a level 5 hyper. How crazy is that? Though, I'm more wondering how this level 5 would actually work in the real match. But that's only time will tell. I'm done with Valentine. Next time is the final episode of Skullgirls Encore, where I will tackle double. And hopefully, that's about it. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. It does mean a lot to me, and it does mean a lot to everyone who watches. And I'll see you guys next time for the finale to Skullgirls Encore.